All right, what is up, my peeps? Wanted to create a quick video to show you how to install a lead conversion Facebook pixel. So this is for those of you that are not using Perfect Storm. If you're using Perfect Storm, obviously you just go into your ads manager here, go into your drop down box, hit pixels, that'll take you here. You just copy and paste this piece of code. We've just made it very, very easy and simplistic for you to do this, right? Um, so for those of you that don't have Perfect Storm though, maybe you have you know, whatever website. So number one, this needs to be installed in order to track leads properly. This needs to be installed on the page, whether it's a thank you page or whatever the page is that um, your lead lands on as soon as they truly register as a lead. So um, whatever website provider you have, you need to make sure that their customer service rep or whoever's installing this understands where to install it. So step number one is I'm going to come here. So I'm in my pixel. So I'm just going to come here again to pixels. I'm going to go actions. I'm going to go view pixel code. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy and paste this code right here. And this kind of gives you a video of where to install this. But this is your pixel for everything. So this isn't going to do you any good by just having this pixel installed. So um, what I do is I'm just going to put this like in like a, a Word document here um, or a note document or whatever. Um, but then uh, right here, so you can see where this says your page view, you know, uh, whatever, uh, parentheses, uh, colon, semicolon, whatever the hell that is. Right before this script, you're going to need to install a special piece of code there. So when I come back in here into my pixel um, information or, or the pixel tab on my ads manager, same place where you copy the pixel, you're going to go here to create a conversion. You're going to go to track conversions with standard events. So here's all your different standard events you can do. Um, for realtors, though, you're really only going to be tracking your leads. So this is really where you want to be. So I'm going to take this piece of code here. So this way I always know it's a lead. So then when I'm uh, selecting my pixel, I know I just go in there and select my lead pixel. Um, so this is the piece of code that I need to copy and install. And I'll always tell you right up here in this little video, it's kind of hard to see, but it'll tell you up here, hey, copy and paste the tracking code. So whether it's like, you know, if I'm selling a t-shirt, I can have a purchase, and it'll tell you right where to install it. But again, in this case, we're just doing it with the leads. So then what I'll do here, again, is it's going to be right after this page view, um, blah, 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 semicolon, colon, whatever the hell that is, right before this script, and I'm going to paste that right in there. So then what I do is I just copy and paste this, um, so then when I'm sending this to uh, you know, my web developer or whatever, um, I'm just going to send them this. So you can see now this shows up the way I need to show it up. So this is what I'm going to email them. So I would just be like, you know, please install this, whoever, blah, blah, blah. Um, on the page that they land on, my leads land on once they fully registered, needs to be on the header of that. So anyway, I hope you found this helpful um, and uh, keep up the awesome work.